endlessly searching for an original scene. Let me double check that I can play this. I love when devs send me a game and tell me it has a non-VR version. And it doesn't. Well, that one I can't do. That, that's terrific. Give me a second. That is frustrating as heck. Let me see what we got. You know what? We'll move on to the visual novel. How does that sound? Let me grab the name of it. Because I can never say the name of this game. It, it happens so much, too. It's kind of sad because that game looked, uh, it looked like it could actually be interesting. Sometimes you gotta have a backup plan. But that means I don't have to stream tonight. <laughs> so it's visual novel time, everybody. Who's excited? More samurais. Then I'll probably go and edit and then go lay down. Please still have my saves. Hold on, let me do something really quick. What'd I do? There we go. That's what I was trying to do. Dayton Samurais. By the way, the second game in this, in this series has to do with vampires. So, it's Samurai Vampires. That sound, that song is copyrighted, and Japan won't let me get away with it. No, they will not. No, I'm on time. お前ら汚せんだよ。この俺の腹の高鳴りをどうしてくれんだ。心配だ。それってただ腹が鳴ってるだけだろ。困るよね、こういう単純な人。お前らが来るまで食い始めるのを待っててやった。俺様の寛大な腹に感謝しやがれ。シンパチ、それ寛大な心だろ。それじゃ、いつものように自分の飯は自分で守れよ。今日も相変わらず世界有名だよな。というわ
<笑>それは体の大きさだ大きい奴にはそれなりに空量が必要なんだよじゃあ育ち盛りの俺はもっともっと食わないとねうんぷん毎回毎回こんなんで済まないな。By the way, let me know if there's an echo. I'm trying to stay away from the mic so that you don't hear it from my neck set. I've、uh, gotten used to it. なれとは恐ろしいものだな。Oh, why aren't you taking anything? うん。あんまりお腹いっぱいに食べるとバカになるしね。おいおいバカとは聞きずぜだがその飯はいただくぜどうぞどうぞ僕はお酒をちびちびしてればいいしじゃあ俺も酒にするかなただご飯とか気にしないでお腹いっぱい食べるんだよあ、あいのあいけんはっぱ feel a little bad though 気にしなくても自分の飯は自分で守れ。OK。Always eating alone made the experience of dinner with these men both an exhilarating and a frightening evening for me.It was actually fun. <笑>最初からそうやって笑ってろ。俺らもお前を悪いようにはしないさ。Harada, his mouth curled into an honest smile of his own. Had I really looked so down? Perhaps they were all trying to cheer me up? It wasn't quite, I wasn't quite sure how to feel. I was conflicted over whether or not to feel pity for myself or to appreciate the moment for what it was. The joy seemed to be winning out, however. And I caught myself smiling as I now entered the room. As usual, his voice was warm, but in his eyes was a level of solemnity I'd never seen before, at least during our brief acquaintance thus far. The warmth of the room slowly evaporated. What? What happened? Ah, the two of you were in the house of the two of you. The two of you were in the house of the two of you. The two of you were in the house of the two of you. Is he going to be alright? I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be able to do it. Oh, thank goodness. I exhaled, I exhaled as a. Hold on. Stop biting my foot. As a brief sigh of relief. But the rest of the room was tense, still itching for an answer. I have a puppy trying to invade me right now. She's trying to jump on my lap. What are you doing, silly? You silly little girl, you were just playing outside. Sujit Chuniwa, Tonsho, and Tadoritskun Janaikana. Soreja, what does she want? Isami Santo Hanashigarka. He turned as he spoke, his last words delivered over his shoulder, and he was gone. She wants snuggles. She wants snuggle bunnies. She's being a snuggle bunny. She's mad that she didn't get to jump in the pool with the guinea pig. It was Sato. Who soon broke the awkward silence. See, that's what happens, Puppy. You tripped. Kenが握れないほどの負荷でか。腕の筋まで立たれているかもしれない。刀は片腕で容易に扱えるものではない。最悪三男さんは二度と真剣を震えまい。Oh, at last I understood. 片腕で扱えば刀の威力は損なわれる。そしてつばぜり合いになれば確実に負けるクスでも何でも使ってもらうしかないですね。サンナンさんも納得してくれるんじゃないかな。そうじ
めったなこと言うもんじゃねえ幹部が羅折になってどうするんだよはあ Wait, that didn't make any sense. Your puppy only mine the house. What are the furies? Oh, Lasset's the one who's a little bit of a kega. Hey, it's okay! Huh? Before I could move, Harada was on his feet and halfway across the room. I barely had time to gasp before he dove his fist into hay. Are you stealing my pillow now? That's what you're doing, aren't you? Hi! Is that my pillow? Is that my pillow? She's being a spoiled brat. Hey, are you alright? やりすぎだぞその悪かったな平助先に口を滑らせたこっちも悪かった大丈夫か悪かったな After a moment, Harada curtly nodded to Hei in apology The latter offering a quick pained smile いや、今のは俺が悪かったけどたくさんのさんはすぐ手が出るんだからな His punch had enough force to knock out a lesser man, but Hei seemed unfazed. It was never clear how different, the, how different these men were. His voice was friendly, but his eyes gave his words a cold weight that made me feel uncomfortable. Furies. These are the creatures from which the Shin, Shin, Shin Sengumi saved the protagonist. Okita takes pity on these poor souls. Okita's voice was flat, emotionless. Um, a sudden chill, a me melancholy, entered his eyes. I couldn't bring myself to say anything more. Thankfully, Naga broke the awkward silence. I was only a guest in their house, not a warrior of the Shinsengumi. You good girl, Miko. She wants hugs. The truth of the Shinsengumi secret were no business of mine, something I'd known. There was little value that's in that sentiment, however. I bit my lip and kept silent. I will be right back. I'm gonna go attack a dog. Nico, you still. There we go. The wall between us was almost was almost tangible, almost far too large an obstacle for me to defeat easily. I finished my dinner in sad silence, excused myself, and returned to my room. I had a great deal to think about. Furies, huh? Hmm. I ordered to my I wondered to myself if the furies referred to the rock the Rakshasa pictured in Buddhist texts. Though I wasn't well versed, I recalled reading a text about a man eating demon god with that name. I have no idea where to start. From drinking the medicine to Captain becoming a fury. Urgh. No, I wasn't supposed to think about these things. 
I was only going to get myself in trouble if I stuck my nose where it didn't belong. Seeing or hearing the wrong thing could kill me. If I die, I'll have a hard time looking for my father. The Shinsengumi captains are keeping themselves hush around me, especially about the Furies. Are they doing it to protect me? Even if I dug around, I'm sure nothing good would come of it. With that in mind, I did my best to clear my head of the evening's events and slipped into my futon. Eighteen sixty four, March. It first approached a month since I began living within the Shinsengumi headquarters. Hiji and Senan finally returned to the compound from their trip to Osaka, but spirits were low. Senan's injury had unforeseen consequences for everyone in the organization. Day-to-day -day operations became hectic for a little while. His wounds seemed quite dire, and they drained whatever goodness in his nature he'd, uh, he'd hoped to keep. Senan would spend days holed up in his room, protected by a barrier of impenetrable silence. If he were to leave his room, a rare occasion now, he was often short-tempered and quickly retreated. Even though I, too, spent days in the exile of my room, he seemed to take it much differently. Senan seemed trapped within a painful memory, each day bringing him closer to a gloomy twilight. I softly pondered what service I could offer to the Shinsengumi if I were not allowed to search for my father. I'm sure Hiji is overwhelmed with whatever business he's dealing with, but I need to visit him. I realize with the tension so high that it's better to have Hiji on my side rather than not. I crept around the hall looking for Hiji, but he was nowhere to be seen. Would it be impolite to visit his room directly? As I paced around the hall in contemplation, an unknown warrior appeared before me. I've been living in the Yagi residence for a month, but he was unfamiliar to me. My current dilemma compelled me to approach him. Um, excuse me, have you seen Hiji? The man turned to respond, and my eyes widened to scan his enormous frame before he spoke. That voice does not fit that face. I'm just gonna say it. Oh, I'm... well, it's kind of a long story. I'm... Anon. Yes. I wasn't aware that they were telling people that I was an apprentice warrior at headquarters. However, my reputation was the last thing on my mind as I faced this man pressuring this man's pressuring gaze. I didn't appreciate the harsh scrutiny he seemed to impose, scanning me from head to toe. Hmm. Someone jealous. I didn't know such thing. So ここは Ken Takeda, Takada, Captain of the Shinsengumi's 5th Division. He has extensive knowledge on Kushu military science, which led to his promotion to War Magistrate, 
He aims to be Kondo's close aide. He grew increasingly agitated, almost like a petulant child, because I refused to answer him. He reached his massive hand over towards me, as if to grab me, but then a voice stopped him. Oi, Takeda! When he recognized Hiji's voice, he snapped his hand back to his side. これは、これは肘方副長。何今度局長に少々用がありましてね。ほう。俺は何も聞いちゃいないが。最近お姿が見えない三段総長の代わりに相談に乗ってほしいと言われているのです。しかし、近藤局長もいらっしゃらないような
あまり外から来たやつと関わるんじゃねえぞ。いいな。Understood, but thank you so much. The next day, and now informed me that I was given more freedom within the headquarters, which allowed me to exit my room freely. My duties included cleaning, laundry, and cooking. Not the most glamorous of chores, of course. However, it gave me opportunity to occupy myself as opposed to going stir crazy in my room. Ah, I looked down into the bucket full of water, and my face stared back, sporting a boy's haircut. I shoved my cleaning rag into the water, and the image disappeared behind the thousands of tiny ripples. I hope I'm doing this right. Oh, yeah, do you think I'm doing this right? 疲れたなら部屋に戻って休むといいお湯がもうすぐ沸くと思うから温かいお茶を持って行ってあげよう Oh no, I'm fine Besides, I told you I wanted to help すまんな何分男女体のせいかうちの連中は武将なものが多くてねた Oops, I didn't mean to cut him off He smiled and squeezed his washcloth into the bucket Though I was embarrassed to say it out loud i n u w o r e a pleasing smile that suited him well Oh, no, nothing. Um, I'm honestly just happy to contribute to the house. Almost on cue, one of the soldiers appeared and called Inu's name. Inoue san, Yamazaki san ga yonde mashta yo. Jun sotsu nitte nitsuite hanashi ga aru toka. Ah, so y e b a u c h i no kumi wa, lai gets no tanto bi ga mada kimatte ina katta ne. ではすまないけれど、少し待つよう山崎くんに言ってくれないかいもう少しで雑巾がけが終わるから。Well, and now I can handle the rest of my own.We're almost done anyway, and I know where the cleaning supplies go. うん。雪村くんがそう言うなら、そうさせてもらおうかね。He wiped his hands and stood up, but before he left, and now bent over to me and whispered. もしあんたの事情を知らない大使が来たらすぐ部屋に入りなさい。面倒なことになりかねないからね。OK。As I now left, I went back to the cleaning the floor. Any passerby would likely avoid me, but more trouble was the last thing I needed. It wouldn't hurt to be extra careful. I was pushing myself to work faster than. No, no, no. Huh? Hey, what are you doing here? What are you doing with that sake? Sake. So, do you think I'm going to go to the house? I'm going to go to the house. 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 I asked him if I could help clean the floor. Really? <laughs> he laughed, but his eyes were still, in, were still thin and sharp, like he was watching carefully for me to make a mistake or slip and reveal some hidden truth. He might have resembled a kid, but he had a maturity and swagger that erased any doubt one may have about him being a shinis, Shinsengumi captain. And so, why do you do so much work? If you work hard, you can get to know your friends. If you do that, it's a mistake. You can stay in the house and stay in the house. No, that's not it at all. I just wanted to do something. You know, I came to Kyoto to look for my father. All I've done so far is sit around and wait. Doing nothing all day is eating up any hope I have, forcing me to turn to turn the thoughts turn thoughts over and over again. Hmm. ほら、この先あるから泣きやめって悪いこと忘れるには酒がいいって言うし。No, it's literally not. 
He shoved the bottle out toward me. Thank you? I'm kind of in the middle of cleaning, though. I don't really think I should drink right now. He slumped against the wall and wallowed in a boyish display of self-pity drinking by himself. Hey, don't tell me you're going to drink here. That's not really what I meant. His display reminded me that even the most mature of us were prone to such boorish moments. However, it really wasn't my place to judge him. Oh, Senen, hello. He glanced over at me but said nothing. Before he may have greeted me, but now. なんか嫌な予感が。おそらく君の予想通りでしょうね。諦めて絞られてきなさい。仕方ね。行ってくるとすっか。あ、そうだ。Yes。いや。三男さんがいてくれりゃ平気か。Um、thanks. He awkwardly shrugged and headed away. It was worrisome, though. His saunter was weighed by a defeated slump. Huh, Senon. What did Hiji want to talk to him about? Ah, Todo-kun wa oshikari o uke ni ikun desu yo. Kyo wa Hijikata-kun no mushi no idokoro ga warui yo deshite ne. Oh no, did he do something? Eh. ここのところ大使が頼んでいるようでその筆頭として普段よく遊び歩いている東道君が目をつけられたというわけですまあ大使への見せしめの意味も込めて数日間の謹慎処分といったところでしょうかほう really? では今まさに酒を飲もうとしていた人間をどうかばえと。東道君たち三人は普段から遊び歩いていますしね。いい薬でしょう。Did Hiji call Naga and Harada too? いえ、あの二人は今は留守のようです。まあ戻ってきたら同様の処分が下されるはずですが。Oh. His words were followed by a long, stiff silence. I felt like I had to say something, so I spoke up. And that's what we're going to do when we get back. Alright guys, that's it for today. I hope you guys did enjoy our choices. And I will see you guys next Thursday for more of Hakao. Well, I might be back tonight. We'll see. For now, guys, I'll talk to you all later. No vamps right now. Sorry. Bye, guys.